Yeah, so, but we all know what it's like to suddenly realize you are a fan of something after a long time of you being exposed to, you know? Maybe you watch the show for years, casually follow the series, you know, or admire the character, only to wake up one day and think, wait, I'm actually a huge fan of this. Yeah, well, these are what I would like to call sleeper fans. The ones who have always been fans, even before they knew it. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah, you already know what this is. This is your boy Gato. This is Anime and Smoke. You dig? So, in this piece, I'm diving into the idea of sleeper fans and how it connects to our love for anime, gaming, and other fandoms. You know? Whether it's stumbling onto a series you've watched in the background for years or discovering your love for characters you know you always admired, we're talking about that moment of realization when you finally embrace your fandom. What is a sleeper fan? Well, a sleeper fan is someone who's been passively engaged with fandom without realizing it. Maybe you casually watched a show here and there, or you had interest in something, but never really thought about it deeply, you know? Then one day something clicks. You're more invested than you thought. And voila, you're a fan. You feel me? You're a sleeper fan. Examples of sleeper fandom. Watching Naruto on and off for years, only to realize later how much you've been keeping up with the characters and the plot. Playing Pokemon casually as a kid and then rediscovering it years later and going all in with the games, shows, and merchandises, you know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. Following Star Wars for years though, you know, that kind of stuff. And then you like the stuff, you like the character, you like the, the, the scenes, you pay attention, but you know, you never really realize you actually have a great passion for something. You know, you just thought it's passive until you realize you have pieces of it around your house that you don't know why or things that about it that you remember it but you still can retain it because you're a sleeper fan bro you've been programmed to like this shit you feel me it's okay it's okay my own sleeper fan experience yeah so here's my personal story as a sleeper fan when i first came across one piece i thought it was cool you know but I didn't consider myself a hardcore fan. I'd watch an episode here and there, talk about it with friends, but I wasn't committed. Fast forward a few years, and I realized I knew every arc, every character's backstory, and even found myself theorizing about future episodes. Turns out, I've been a fan all along. Yeah. How sleep of fandom happens? Sleep of fandoms often comes from casual exposure. You see something repeatedly or follow a trend without fully diving in. You might know the characters, quotes, and the storylines, but never fully recognize your involvement, you know? It's like you're slowly absorbing the culture until it clicks. Yeah, for my sleeper fans, anime is a prime example. Maybe you watched Dragon Ball Z as a kid because it was on TV. Maybe you caught random episodes of Yu-Gi-Oh! Without thinking much of it, years later, you're re-watching the series, and suddenly, you're deep into the lore, trading cards, or... Uh, Binge watching episodes on a Saturday night. You a sleeper fan, my boy? You a sleeper fan? The wake up call. For every sleeper fan, there's a moment of realization. Maybe you caught yourself humming the theme song, reading up a character's backstory, or getting way too excited for a new season or game release. That's when you know you've been a fan all along. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. Why sleeper fans are important to fandoms? Well, sleeper fans keep fandoms alive in unexpected ways. They're the ones who suddenly reignite interest in old shows, games, or content. They bring new perspective while often rediscovering the joy and excitement of a franchise that may have been overlooked. Conclusion So are you a sleeper fan? Have you ever suddenly realized that you are more into a series, a game, or a fandom than you originally thought? I want to hear your stories. Share how you became a sleeper fan and what made you wake up to your hidden fandom. Who knows? You might just get some free merch. 
Jazaya. It's Gato. I'm out. Peace.